In this video, I want to show you how you can export an entire sales navigator search into a spreadsheet without having to copy paste manually information from LinkedIn or to use a scraper and then many different email finders in order to find people's emails. There's a tool called Scalelist uh, that basically enables you to create email lists right from LinkedIn sales navigator. And the result of what you would get is something like this, where you get people's LinkedIn URLs, sales navigator profile, uh, first name, last names, the job title, company, industry, the company size, many other information that you need, and it's going to enrich it with professional emails whenever it finds them. So let me walk you through how it works. Simply, you can create a free account here. Let's put in uh, a name. Here's mine. I put an email address. You can put in a password. Here you go. And in the sign-in process, it'll just going to ask you for some more information about yourself, wherever you're located. I'm currently in, in Hong Kong. So I'm going to call it scale list. Here you go, you can select your company size. Super simple uh, first process. I am in sales at the moment, so I'm gonna use it for sales as well. And whether I need phone numbers or not, I'll say yes. And then I'm ready to go. Whenever you click on this, it's gonna prompt you to install the Chrome extension in order to be able to use it on LinkedIn Sales Navigator. So let's do that right away. As you can see here, I can click on Add to Chrome, add the extension, and here we go, I got the extension. So what you have to do now is simply go back to Sales Navigator. You'll see there's a button that's going to appear here on the top right hand corner. But what you need to do is simply refresh your page. And here you go. You see this little button that appeared saying extract email list with the Scalist logo here. So now let's do a test search to see how the tool works. We'll find head of human resources. OK, um, let's say we search for these people in London. It can be anywhere in the world. For information, if you have a search that has more than 2,500 results, you'll have to break it down into multiple searches because you can export only a maximum of 2,500 search results. So let's select another industry, say financial services, for example, and we can pick different headcounts as much as you want. So here you go. I pick these ones, uh, 81 results. Simply what I need to do now, instead of copy pasting everything into a spreadsheet and then searching also for different email finders, I simply have to click on extract email list. It's going to prompt me onto scale list and it's going to tell you how long it's going to take. So if your first export is over 80 profiles, it's going to tell you that you cannot export more than this because your daily limit has been set at 80. This is just a safety measure, but just note that you can actually do it uh, up to 2,500 results. One information to keep in mind though, is that for the free trial, you have 20 email credits as well as two phone credits that you can use within 14 days. So if I go back here, I can simply continue and it's going to launch the export. Now it's telling me how long it's going to take. It's just queuing it up. And I'm going to pause it, of course, in order to make sure we don't waste too much time on the video. So here now it tells me that I have exported 81 results with 31 valid emails and 23 risky emails. What here it says is that simply I have 31 emails that I can actually use and 23 where we cannot, we can deliver the emails, but we cannot tell you whether they are functioning or not. And these are up for you to try. And information that is important to keep here is that you are only charged for valid emails, but you are never charged for risky emails. So risky emails are always free and the credit counts that you have here has already been uh, exported for me is just for valid emails. You can look through your list very briefly here, see okay what you, what you have. It's gonna show up as hidden because it, I went above my email criteria. If I wanna unlock these emails, I'll have to uh, upgrade because I found over 20 emails for the first export. I'm gonna show you how a full export looks like. So you can simply export it here on CSV or export it as an Excel with uh, this little button here. So I'm gonna go on my drive and I'm gonna pull up the CSV. Google Sheets, and then it's going to open the exact file. As I said, it's going to give me 20 emails for the credits that I have on the free trial. The other ones will not show uh, necessarily. I have to upgrade to do it, but you have enough emails now to try at least if the tool works and it gives you everything. All done in a matter of a few minutes instead of doing it manually or using multiple tools to find everybody's emails or export your searches and combine it too much. One click and you're ready to go.